What up, what up world, this is your homeboy Wordplay TJ and I'm back with another video for you. This time around I want to talk about how to promote your music to vloggers so you can get extra attention around the things that you're making. Stay tuned. So recently I was trolling around my comment and I found a particular comment that kind of asked about how uh, a person can get their music into the hands of, say, movies, television, and, and things of that nature. So there's some resources out there. So if you Google it, you can find licensing companies and you can find um, big music libraries that you can submit music to. That's cool, that's fine and dandy, but I wanna take a 2017 approach to this solution. And one way is submitting to vloggers. So I know this may be a little bit difficult or tricky to think about, but I wanna be able to simplify the concept so you can figure out exactly how to get your music to vloggers, why you should get your music to vloggers, and how it can benefit you in the long term. So as of 2015 or 2016, I started thinking that I need to get my music out to people that will license my music or use my music in videos, movies, television, etc. And I didn't know how to really go about doing this. So I enrolled in courses and I Googled stuff and I looked around, looked around, looked around. And what I found out is that the, um, the barrier to entry is really, really steep to getting to people in um, television, movies, etc. It's not impossible because with a lot of hard work, you can really get to someone and form those relationships. At the same time, I think there's a easier way around it. I think there's a way that you can reach people um, that need music and you can have them use your music in their videos. And I think that one way is connecting with vloggers, videographers, and people that make videos and distribute them on YouTube and other platforms. So along my search, I started looking for people that make vlogs, that make um, other video content on YouTube, and I started listening first. So that's the, that's the first step really, is to listen. Take a step back and listen to what they're creating. Do you hear the soundtrack? Do you hear the type of music that they're putting in the background of their videos? If it sounds like the type of music you make, then it might be a great fit for you to reach out to them. And reaching out to them is very, very simple. Usually they have a about section or they have some contact on social media. So just reach out and say, hey, I have five or six songs that may fit into your uh, collection of videos. If you like them, you can add them, just please tag me or something like that and just form a mutual bond. You wanna give them some value for using your music. And in return, you'll get something back. You might get a little bit of traffic. You might get somebody listening to uh, your music that has never heard your music before. And in turn, over the long run, it'll turn into revenue and it'll turn into fans. And you can start to build your career off of placing your music in vlogs and other videos on YouTube. So one of my best examples of doing this is when I submitted music to D-Rock, who's uh, the main videographer over at uh, VaynerMedia. If you know anything about Gary Vaynerchuk, he's a serial entrepreneur. He puts out a vlog every day. He does Ask Gary V, and he does tons and tons of content around social media platforms. And every single piece of that content needs some music. And so I thought it was a no-brainer to reach out to the main person that was doing the videos, D-Rock. So when my album job application came out, I hit up D-Rock with a link to my album, which had like full versions, clean versions, and also some instrumentals as well. So he can add that music to the videos that he was working on. So lo and behold, after forming that relationship, I actually gave D-Rock some value and he had something that he could actually use in uh, in some of the videos that he was he was editing. So at that point, he was able to place 
of some of my instrumentals, some of my music into Gary Vaynerchuk's videos. And that started to snowball into building fan base, building relationships, and just growing my overall brand. And I can't say thank you enough to D-Rock and the team over at Vayner Media because they have really, really changed my career for the better. So really quick, I'm gonna show you an example of somewhere where my music has been placed in videos that Gary Vaynerchuk has created. Mark asks, who are the idols or the people that inspire you? Did you ever have a mentor? So now that you've seen that, you see how important it is to reach out to vloggers and videographers and try to get your music out there. Um, there's so many platforms that are needing music. So Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and the list goes on. Everybody needs music for their videos right now, and it's your time to place it. One result that came from pushing all this music to D-Rock and VaynerMedia is that my music got featured in a spot Spotify playlist called Daily V Selects and I'm really really fortunate to be on that playlist so it has my song someone else's dream linked down in the description featured on that playlist and that playlist gets hundreds of plays a day so I'm benefiting from that that's revenue coming into my business so I can invest that into myself and then make more music and that's what you want. You want a long-term career and you're not betting on just the high dollar transactions. You're betting on the long-term, day after day after day because you don't wanna go broke 30 years from now. And as long as you own your catalog, as long as you own your publishing, you're gonna be great. So get out there and push, push, push. Make those connections and form those relationships because you never know what could happen. You might even end up on a Spotify playlist and get hundreds of plays a day. Until next time, leave a comment down in the comments section and subscribe to this channel. Go ahead and hit that notification button for videos that I produce every so often. And until next time, peace.